Oh, like, City Hall's back. Doing what he does best. Ape Escape 3. Slob. Not that slob, hopefully. But we, uh, we're back. We're bald. Balder than ever. You know, doesn't get more bald than I am right now. I've been bald for a while. I've experienced... You know, I, I had, like, going into this, I had, like, 15 anecdotes set up. Can't remember any of them. None. I have the splits working. That's incredible. That, I don't even think that's, like, happened before. Oh, never mind. I didn't do it right. Well, <laughs> it's okay. It's not going on the, the website anyway. If this PBs, I'll, uh, I'll eat my shorts. I'm wearing jeans. I think, I don't think I own shorts. I can check, actually. I'm, like, right by my drawer. I do not own shorts. And I forgot to do the split. All right. <laughs> it's going good. Uh, how have I been? How was my day? Uh, that's a trick question. My day was bad because all I did was get up, shower, shave my head, and then for about two hours working on trying to get OBS to capture the... PS2. It, it's crazy how uh, a, like, what, 10-year-old, probably more, uh, your old console that you've had working in the past perfectly could could just not work. And then, <laughs> but fix the problem was I, I just restarted my computer for the third time and then all of a sudden it was work. Then, you know, I, I know that was bad. I don't, I don't think you're looking for any landmark plays here. Uh, definitely bad routing on that guy as well. It's been a long time since I've played Ape Escape. Uh, since I've been City Hall as well. I'm pretty sure I wasn't even supposed to get that guy. It's just that all the speedruns I've been watching get that guy because they can do a little helicopter trick. You do a quad jump in midair without the, the hoop. I can't even do it with the hoop. Uh, I don't know where I'm supposed to split, so I'll just do it there. You know, basically... Whenever I figure it out. Oh, I, you know, that's not. Nah, I, I, I split in the wrong level. I wasn't supposed to split after the first monkey. That was my bad. So, I don't know if I can undo that. We're just gonna, you know, who cares? We'll, we'll have it fixed, I swear. No, I definitely don't. That's not, that's not a promise I can keep. I have... No clue if at the end of this level I'm gonna remember not to hit the split button. Actually, I I do have a I have a clue. You know, let, let's give it a percentage. I get mm, twenty percent chance I remember. I don't think it's a very generous estimate. In fact, you know what? It's my show. I'm running it. I can change it. I'm giving myself forty percent chance I remember. That's right. I you have a lot of power when you're running a one man conversation. It's hard, you know, uh, I think Uncle Ben, uh, big power, big responsibility. That's the quote, word for word. Don't, uh, don't look it up. You don't have to. I, I'm very good at uh, what I do. This is my job. This is not my job. I think if it was my job, I'd... Well, I, I wouldn't be doing it right now. If it was my job, I'd be dead. I actually, no, I, I come from a... You know, my parents could definitely support me if this was my job and I made zero money. Uh, but it's not my job. I don't currently have a job. I worked at Walmart. I think I probably gave that anecdote at some time in the past. It's, I don't know, it's been like two years. I forget what I've been talking about. <laughs> some things never change. Talking about Lambimon. Oh, I remembered. We hit that 40% chance. I didn't split. This is looking like a good video. Actually, though, I'm pretty sure my time is like garbage. Yeah, I mean... It's probably like 20 seconds off from the best I can do, which is not, you know, it sounds small, but that is, that's pretty bad. We're not going for good, though. We're, we're going for, for my sake. Oh, did I hit the training room? Did I do, I think I did. <laughs> oh, this, I, and I don't remember the menus. It's a good speed run. <laughs> I'd reset if it wasn't such a pain to get the recording to work. Alright, you gotta hit square there. Uh, here's an anecdote. I'll, I'll tell you if you promise not to tell anyone else, but um, 
I, I joined the environmental club because there was a, a girl or, you know, a non-gender binary person. So I'm just going to say a, a person. There was a, a person that I liked in it. And I don't care about the environment at all. So I'm out here trying to hide the fact that I use plastic bottles and, like, don't recycle. I only recycle when it's convenient. Uh, so, yeah, the, the, if you see anyone, just anyone in general, don't don't tell them City Hall uses plastic bottles. Because uh, I don't anymore. But, but don't tell them I did. Don't tell anyone. And, uh, you know, <laughs> if the person's watching this, uh, then don't... I don't think they will. <laughs> because I would never let the info get out now that this video's here. But, uh, City Hall is not Andrew. That's not... You got the wrong guy. And Andy doesn't use plastic bottles, and he never has. Not that I would know, because I'm not that guy. Uh, what's some other anecdotes? Did I, did I mention how I'm bald yet? Being bald is, like, kind of hard. Like, don't get me wrong, the benefits outweigh the negatives. Uh, first off, I look good. That's, I think, the primary reason. Second off, rain, time to dry, nil. I just rub my head, suddenly, entire body's dry. Used to be, had to wait like 20 minutes for my hair to dry. Uh, negatives of being bald, I have to shave it every day. It takes time. Uh, another negative? Uh, well, let, let, let's, you know, it will go negative into positive. I know I did two positives, but there's more positives than negatives, so I think it's okay. Uh, what's, what's the next positive, Eggman? Well, uh, <laughs> don't call me Eggman, it's degrading. Uh, the second positive is I get to make egg jokes. You know, I get to be like, hey, what's up, bros? And then my new catchphrase is, egg out. Are you kidding? All right. You know, they just came three. It's a mean game. It's it's a lot of randomness for an hour and a half speed run, but that that's okay when you don't care about your time. I think I'm going to run out of fantasy night before. Was this Monrella? Ukita. That's not a real name. <laughs> that's Japanese propaganda. Uh... Alright, well, what, get back to the funny egg jokes. <laughs> the egg man, I told you to stop calling me that. Uh, what's, what's the next negative? Well, sometimes it gets cold at night, so I have to wear a sleeping cap. I don't mind wearing the sleeping cap. The problem is my roommate makes fun of me because I look like a goon. Uh, by the way, remember to split. This is a blessed run. Um, because I look like a total goon. Which is, you know, it's true. And the only reason I'm not listing the negative as I look like a total goon is because he's the only one that's seeing it. So really, it wouldn't be a negative if, you know, he didn't make fun of me for it. Which he doesn't have to. And I don't really mind. So it's not a huge negative. Like I said, big positives, small negatives. Uh, what's the next positive? I get to, I have an excuse to wear that now. You know, because I, I love hats, and before I'd wear, like, the same hat every day, and people would be like, why do you like that hat so much? And I'd go, oh, I don't know, it's, uh, I like it, and whatever. Uh, now, I can say, it's to prevent sunburn. You know, it's dark, 8 p.m., raining. Oh, I just, I got used to wearing it, because I have to wear it to prevent sunburn. And now, I can wear whatever I want. It's like, um... It's, it's like, oh, split. Ooh, did I split twice? No, I didn't. We're, we're golden. All right. Uh, what is it? I was on, I was on the egg. I'm trying to remember what I was talking about. About the egg. Yeah, the hats. All right. Uh, yeah, so it's like being sick, you know? When you're sick, you get the excuse to eat ice cream. And it's like, why are you eating ice cream? And I go, ooh, I'm sick. Yeah, it's like, hey, what, what, <laughs> why you have that hat on, Eggman? And I go, ooh, it's, uh... It's sunburn. My poor head. My my mom tells me I have to wear it. That's, you know, if, if you're in an argument and you want to end the argument on top, just tell them my mom said this. And then there is no way they can argue. Mom comes top. Top priority number one. If mom, if you're listening to this, and I know she's not because there's no way she'd get 10 minutes into a video about Ape Escape 3. Not about Ape Escape 3. On Ape Escape, an Ape Escape 3 video, as they said. Uh, bad director room, that one's for you, Sean. 
I know Sean watches these. He's probably the only one. That and my cousin Ryan. Sean because he likes to get fuel to make fun of me, and Ryan because he genuinely enjoys the content. Possibly the only one besides myself. Oh, it's close. I don't really remember the timing for this, but uh, I do remember I've been an idiot for my entire life because I could just quad jump it. Yeah, it's like way easier. I don't know why I never did it. No one ever mentioned it in the comments. Yeah, you know, if you guys have a problem with my Ape Escape play, that's, uh, that's something I can fix easily, hit me up. You know, put it in the comments. <laughs> don't call me Eggman, though. I hate it. Not because not of the Sonic thing, just, you know. I, here's a list of things you can call me. City Hall. Not Andrew Calvary's, because we can't have the truth of the plastic bottles coming out. Uh, and uh, you can call me... Hmm, uh, Zothar, Grand Archmage Magician. There, I got that so fast. <laughs> that trick usually takes, like, a good... I, I want to say 10 minutes, but realistically, it's, it's just, it takes a reset. <laughs> the game usually gets reset after that trick. Am I missing a monkey, or did he, he, he ran away? Alright, that, that is much better. <laughs> yeah, if, if you're missing a monkey there, it's a reset. And I really don't want to reset the run, because the- oh, split! Oh, and I'm on the right split. <laughs> Blessed run. Yeah, and I don't want to reset, because it's really hard to set everything up over and over again. You know, I'm not even... I think it might be a decent jump. I mean, <laughs> I read the quad jump split. It might be a decent run. I don't think it's gonna PB. But, uh... It might not be embarrassing, I think, are the words I'm looking for. Alright, let's see if there's any more positives and negatives I could squeak out about being bald. It's, it's the anecdote that keeps giving. Uh, first off, switch to the, the slingshot. That's not... That ain't how you do it. That's how you do it. Uh, I mean, a lot of people who knew you in the past, uh, I'm, I'm speaking as if you're going to be bald, uh, a lot of people that knew you in the past are going to be like, why'd you choose the bald life? And, uh, and you know, the easy answer is it chose me, but that, I think that's, that's untrue. I think it, it's hard to force yourself to get into the mindset of, I want to be bald, it's a lot easier to, to be thinking. Baldness is very long term until my hair will grow back. So like, even though I think it's gonna be a positive, it's a big risk. We're staying where I am is zero risk. I don't wanna say you can't think like that because I think it'll benefit you in many of uh, your other f ev avenues of life. Avenue? Avenue? It yeah, it'll assist you later in life if you think like that. However, you should go bald, because it's the best and superior. And when it rains, you don't have to dry off. I have a... It's raining, and my friends will be like, Hey, you want to borrow an umbrella? And I'll be like, You don't own an umbrella. No, no one in this suite owns an umbrella. Except for one guy, and he's not here. But, hypothetically, if this fake person I made up did offer me an umbrella, I'd say, nah, you can have it. I don't need it. A natural built umbrella on my chrome domium. That's another thing, is like, I, I shave the head, it doesn't get, like, it gets shiny, but it doesn't get, uh, oh, there, there's a term in the bald community. Now that I'm a member of the, of the bald community, I have these terms. It's, uh, BBS. Baby butt smooth is what they call it. And you shouldn't go for it because it causes razor burn or something. But, yeah, I'm a... Apparently, they, they hate my kind because I use a, a cartridge razor. And they only... Or a safety razor? The, the one with multiple blades. They want the single blade one. They're, they're like, if you, if you don't use a single blade razor, you're not really bald. You're just posing. And you know, I'm I'm alright with just posing. If if it looks this good. And you know, pe people say most of them, they like the bald. Some of them, it's an unwelcome change. And uh and I respect it. My my Asian wife Nana, not actually my wife, I just say that every time I talk about her. Uh I asked her, I say, 
Uh, she will first, she comes to me and says, Andrew, you shaved your head, looks good. Uh, forgive my racist Japanese accent, I'm trying my hardest. Uh, I asked her, I said, is, is there any word for bald in Japanese? And she goes, bored. And I'm like, all right, is, is there any, uh, is there any more like Japanese sounding ones? And then she goes, hmm, skinhead. And I'm, and I'm like, ah, oh, all right. That, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna use that. If, <laughs> all, all right. City Hall viewers, most of you probably know me, even if you just watch the videos. If you ever catch me saying a Japanese word that's just an English word with the syllables mixed up, like if I ever say, like, if I'm, if I'm trying to say, uh, what's a good example besides bald or skinhead? If I'm trying to say, like, anime, and I say anime, kill me. It's not the real City Hall. That you got the wrong guy. No, officer, please. I didn't mean it. <laughs> I'm, I ain't that type of guy. Uh, yeah, I will never do that. And if you ever catch me doing it, I'm, I'm too far gone. Don't save me. Don't come back for me. I want you to unsubscribe. It's a city hall promise. You know, it's it's a lot uh, It's a lot easier once you get to, to Boo Town to play the game. Because, like, once you're here... It, uh, nothing matters anymore. No one's watching except for Sean and your little cousin. They already love you. Nothing you say could ever change that. Well, alright. If I say Sean loves me, you think, I, you think I'm gay. Ryan loves me a cousinly love. Sean, <laughs> with acquaintances, is the best I can muster out of him. Friend? Ah, uh, nah. Friends? That's gay. <laughs> Don't get me wrong, I love him. But, you know, you didn't hear it out of me. A, a friendly love, you know, like a, you know, ooh, I love hot dogs. I, I don't really love hot dogs. You know, they're, they're right. I didn't even know that move existed. I was trying to do the, I did know the move existed. I forgot the move existed. Uh, I was trying to do the, the super hoop. You know the one. Speed run dream. All right, here we go. Moment of truth. Is it a reset? Not gonna reset, but is it a, <laughs> 10 minutes of doing this? Oh, so quick! That's not the suit. I usually have the super hoop on circle, don't I? That's gonna mess up my muscle memory if I don't fix that. Never mind, it's always on square and I'm dumb. Nope, hold on. This is, you know, it's slowing down the time. It's an important fix. It'll save time later, I assure you. Oh, okay, I'll take that. Oh, never mind. Sally's the hard one. Oh, what a catch! Oh, I want you to start calling me Monkey Lord or Egg Lord. You know what? Egg Lord's good too. I'll take Egg Lord. Yeah, I don't know if my super hoop's supposed to be on circle or on square. I think it's on circle because that that uh that interaction felt wrong. I definitely did not mean to whip out the slingshot there, and we got this so quick. You know what? This is looking like a good run. I ain't mad. You know what? I think it's circle. Because I remember having trouble with quad jumps, so I should probably get used to it on square, honestly. But, uh, I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> you don't come here for intelligent gameplay. You come here for me. Which is, you know, it's, I'm very flattered. That, uh, you think my content is worth watching. Or, you know, maybe, maybe no one's watching it. I'm gonna watch it. That's, that's a complete and utter lie. There is, I forgot to split on both of these. The run is no longer blessed. Um, yeah, that's a total lie. It, I, another thing, if you ever catch me watching my videos alone, which you can't do because if you're catching me, I won't be alone. Uh, I'm gonna put it on square, by the way. Uh, which you will never do because you can't catch me alone. The, because, not because I won't be alone, but you, you get the idea, you're a smart kid. Um, if you ever catch me watching my videos alone, it's not me, again. It, <laughs> I just pictured a guy that looks exactly like me, sitting in his room alone. How do I skip this cutscene? <laughs> sitting in his room alone, going, mm, Daisuke, uh, anime, Boruto, and I'm like, ah. That's not what I sound like. That's not- that ain't me. 
I sit in my room alone and watch Northern Lion videos. And you know, I sure hope no one watching this watches Northern Lion because two years of watching Northern Lion videos, you start to sound a lot like him. Uh, oh, you know, I, I have had an up upload recently. That Captain Planet video absolutely smacked. Everyone loved it. Why am I bothered? The, the quad jump is going to take so long to, to get. Just, just bite the bullet. Come back up here. There you go. Yeah, Uki Gigolo? I could take it. Actually, it's, uh... Ukiki! Oh... It's broken. <laughs> and you know, I'm not a... I think Uki might... Or Ukiki or something might be the noise that monkeys make in Japan. Or rather, the noise that Japanese people think that monkeys make. And my only basis for that is there's a bunch of Ape Escape monkeys with Uki in their name. Ape Escape 3 to be specific. And there's a bunch... The, the Mario... Uh, I was gonna say Mario Party Bear. This is just Mario. The monkeys from Mario... Their names are, I think it's Uki, or Ukiki, or something. Um, yeah, so, there's there's the theory, take it or leave it. Uh, if we get train skip quickly, I'm a, I'm a tech lord. Alright, officially, not a tech lord. But, you know, I'm still going for it, it's like my favorite skip, I love it. If the video's a half hour long, now you know why. It's cause I, ooh, are we in? I'm in! That was not that bad. I mean, way, way slower than pushing the button, don't get me wrong, but like, I'm proud of myself. I didn't save time, I'm just proud. And you know, that's all that really matters in life. Well, not really. <laughs> that, that's, uh, that's, you know, maybe for a loser. Not, unlike me, total not loser. Oh, you know, there's a lot of momentum on jumping off poles. And I'm glad for it, but sometimes it ain't, it ain't right. They do me dirty. You know, it, I wanna, I don't, it's so, I don't wanna call Ape Escape 3 racist, but like, is Ape Escape 3 racist? <laughs> I really don't think so. But I'm supposed to go into cowboy mode for that. Oh, Sean's gonna be so upset with me. I, I can see it now. In in approximately a day from now, I'm gonna receive a text message from Sean. Why didn't you go into your cowboy trigger for the button push? It would have saved like so many frames. This is, I don't think it's called cowboy trigger. I'm, I'm mixing it with double trigger. I've been watching a lot of Marvel. Ooh, hit the split. Plus and run! Um, I've been watching a lot of Ultimate Marvel vs. Capcom 3. That game's hype. You got Dante with Devil Trigger, you got Virgil with like Virgil Trigger or whatever he calls it. I don't, I don't freaking know. Uh, but yeah, dude, it's got wacky cancels, it's got uh, hot tech infinites. A lot of infinites in, <laughs> in Marvel 3. Unlike Marvel Infinite, which I think has like an infinite prevention system. I would not be surprised. Most most modern games do, except for Marvel 3, for some reason. I I wouldn't call Marvel 3 modern, actually. I'd call it like uh you know, it's certainly not retro. I mean, maybe, maybe some people do think it's retro. I, I'm uh I don't know what's retro anymore because I think I'm old in the gaming world. I think you know, all the ten year olds are playing Fortnite. I get on my Fortnite game and I'm like, oh yeah. I uh I remember this this gun. It's a reference to Doom 2, and then they're like, uh, oh, what's a Doom?" And I'm like, "Oh, no! What are you? Why do you not know what the that game's the best?" <laughs> I don't even. I, I don't even know if Doom 2 is a real game, and I've definitely never played it. I'd imagine it is because like Doom was quite popular, and there was a Doom remake. Surely there wasn't just no games in between that period. A dredge of Doom games, if you will. I don't know what dredge means, I just know it's a keyword in Magic. And like, most of the keywords that they put on the black cards are like, you know, some kind of plague. Uh, not plague. Um, you know, they're, they're bad things. They're things you don't want. Dredge? Maybe it means the absence of something, I don't know. 
I think it does. I think uh, I think I should look up Dredge. I honestly, I was only like 10% confident that there was a monkey in here. I'm glad. I'm glad I uh, I took the risk. You know, the risk of of losing two seconds on the run for less than two seconds. One one bump on the run versus the risk of just totally flubbing the whole level, like I am right now, actually. Ooh, never mind. Fastest quad jump in the West. I live in the East, no matter how you look at it. Wait, wait, yeah, the East. Sorry, yeah. You know, to this day, whenever I do the compass direct- I should have kept my RC car. Uh, whenever I do the compass directions, I always go, alright, North is up, uh, South is down, those are easy, you know, down South, it's your posterior region. Uh, and then, for West and East, I remember we, and for some reason, I can't remember west to the left, east to the right. I have to spell out we in my head, every, literally every time. And then I go, well, how do you spell we again? Is it a W? And I go, oh yeah, W's for west. And I will literally, I will never do it the normal human way. I have to do it that way every time. So if I'm ever trying to figure out which way am I oriented outside? I go, it's a it's a many step process. I go, first locate the sun. Sun located, done. Find its arc in the sky. Uh, well, no, second is figure out the time. Are you in the AM or are you in the PM? If, uh, let, let, for this example, we're in the AM. Or, no, you know what, the PM. I, I never wake up before 12 anyway. So we're in the PM. I jumped very high. Uh, that means, the sun, and then I remember, the sun rises in the east and sets in the west. It's just one of those sentences that are stuck in my head, like Omochow going, Oh, we failed to land correctly, uh, from Sonic Riders. It's stuck in there permanently, can't get it out. Uh, but anyway, I'm doing a lot of but anyway today. I think that's the sign of a good video, because it probably means I haven't stopped talking. Uh, but anyway, <laughs> I was on the sun, right? So, rises in the east, sets in the west. That, that means, it, because it's in the PM, uh, we're, we're setting, so it's in the West. No, rises in the East, sets in the West. Yes, that's correct. Okay, so it's in the West. It sets in the West. You know, it's hard to play Ape Escape and talk and remember, and the thing that is hard to remember for you to remember in the first place. So, it's setting in the West, which means, uh, it's, well, then we need to figure out which way is, is West, and that's, that's we. So we know it's setting in the left direction relative to north. So you put the sun to your left, and then you face forward, and then you go, I'm facing north. And then you have to look at the map, you have to orient the map so that you're facing north, and then you can just ask your mom and be like, Mom, which, which way do we go again? And, you know, it, it's a long it's a long process. It seems like a long process because I explained it in a matter of... Um, like three minutes by the way split uh but you know really i, I do it all in like two seconds the brain is, is an amazing tool and that's really all it is to me is a tool not a not a necessary life function or anything. just you know something i can use from time to time and trust me i, I don't use it often as as you can see all right you know, uh, one thing I missed from Ape Escape 2, among a couple of other things, they really, uh, the monkey names in this game, they stink. They, they're Japanese, I don't know enough Japanese to, to know what that means. Oh, I, there's, you know what, I have a great bit about Japanese that I'll save for, the, for if the time comes, but I'm glad I thought of it, and I hope it comes on video, and I honestly don't think it ever will, but, uh, you're not getting it until the timing's right. And, uh, you know, I suppose I, I should address the elephant in the room that's been in the room for, for quite some time. Uh, 28 minutes and 42 seconds, to be exact. Or, you know, a little less than exact. T minus, uh, 28 and 49. Uh, it's been in the room for that long, and the elephant is, is there gonna be City Hall videos from now on? Uh, I don't know. Uh, I had fun with this one. I'm not sure if... Uh, I'm going home from college soon. I'm not sure if that environment will be suited to City Hall. That's not to say it won't be. I'm just unsure. 
get, give us a percent chance, Eggman. All right, I will. Stop calling me Eggman. <laughs> Gosh darn it. I, I'm telling you for the final time. Uh, but anyway, the, again, but anyway, I'm not going to apologize for it. It's just going to something you're going to have to deal with because there's no way I can stop it. So, <laughs> uh, first net flip coming up. Big deal. Let's see if I can remember how to do it. Uh, what's the elephant in the room? I'll tell you after I hit this sweet net float. Radio silence. <laughs> I'm, I'm not copying from Northern Lion, I swear. That's something he says a lot, in case you're unaware. Which I, you know, I expect you to be, but... Don't, uh, it's not a mandatory thing that you are. <laughs> Definitely took way longer than just jumping up there, but that that's the nature of Ape Escape 3 speedrunning for me. Just just get the tech. Thank you for not calling me Eggman. Hypothetical, Andrew. That's actually the audience. Uh, oh, you know, I did address the elephant in the room. I forgot that uh, what I was talking about was... That's not to say I'm unsure if it's going to be a good environment. I just don't know. So give us the percent chance. And then that's when you called me Eggman. Now I remember what we're getting at. All right, we're back in the conversational loop. So what's the percent chance? I think it's, uh, I'm gonna give it the same chance that this run doesn't get a reset. 38, a little less than 40. Why not just 40? Eh, I, I don't know. This, <laughs> it was 40 and then I ran into this guy. We'll say that. Split. Remind me to shop. I have to shop. The splits reminded me. <laughs> Usually I like to bring a partner to Ape Escape 3, specifically so they can remind me to go to the shop. But the splits do it for me now. You know, I'm actually, I'm gonna put on my fuzzy hat, and I'm gonna open the, no, I'm not gonna open the window. I'm just gonna put on the hat. Oh, you're losing frames, you're losing time. Yeah, shut up. I know you don't really believe that. That's just me talking in a stupid voice. If you care about the run timer more than I do, then what, what's wrong? You, you gotta get your priorities in order. Maybe... Eh? Oh, you know what? There's a knock on my door. Hello? Yeah, I'm yeah. recording City Hall. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, hell yeah. Rock on Egg Out Brothers. That was... My sweet mate John Keasley would like to tell you to egg out. <laughs> and I, I agree, you definitely- you should egg out, man. <laughs> oh, we don't have enough money. Like at all. I forget what we need all these explosive pellets for, but I think I need more than two. I wonder where all the money went. Not that I really mind. And you know, we'll, we'll make up for the time lost by taking the door and getting the hat on. We'll make up for it by uh, doing this level real good. We're gonna we're gonna get that. Uh, I think there's a trick in this level, I have to... There's a trick in every freaking level, man. You know, I'm using very old routing, and uh, it's also routing modified to my skill level. So, like, world record, it's not in the cards. It just, it ain't for me. Also, why, why didn't that... Why didn't you go? You know, I, I could feel my voice going out, and I know you, I know you can hear it. So, uh... I'm gonna go ahead and take a swig of water after getting this time and then pausing. And you know you might have heard that water bottle, and it's it's I've got a I got beef with that water bottle, man. It's it's very noisy, you know, when you suck it it goes or like you know or I can't really replicate the noise because I'm not uh, uh, airtight plastic, but um so the reason for that is there's this little little dongle inside the water bottle that's supposed to hold the straw to the- it's a straw water bottle, by the way. It's supposed to hold the straw to the, the liquid, I guess? You know, keep it liquid tight. It also keeps it semi-airtight, which creates, I think, the same phenomenon that, like, instruments have. It, it vibrates a lot, and then it goes... Vroom! 
So I obviously I hate it. So I, I loosen the seal and then more air enough air gets through that it's not an instrument anymore. And then uh, you know you're good to go. But you're not good to go. You put it in your backpack, you go to you go to calculus class, and then at the end of calculus class you lift up your bag and it's dripping. It's dripping wet. What's going on? I don't, I don't remember opening any containers. But you do remember opening containers. It was the container. It's, it's too... If it's too small for air to get through, or too small for... Hold on. If it's big enough for air to get through, it's big enough for water to get through. And, you know, such a bulky water bottle in such a small bag, there's no way you're gonna keep it straight up. Your water's gonna spill. You're gonna have a little puddle at the end of it. So I'm like, all right. Tighten it back up again. Tighten it so tight so the air can't get through. Obvious problem. I think extremely obvious unless you're stupid. The, now now that air can't get through, the water can't get through either. Now you're, you're you gotta suck real hard like you're sucking through sucking a, a thick smoothie through a paper straw. Not a paper straw. One of those eco-friendly straws. You know all these uh yeah, I, I've become cynical about the environment ever since joining Environmental Club when I actually hate the environment. Uh, it's made it even more cynical. And now, these little straws, they say. Oh, the straws, they save the environment and they, they do nothing bad. Just use the green straw or skip the straw. And I'm all for skipping the straw. I've got, I've got a metal straw. I've got a, so usually I just use no straw, but you know, when I have a drink, I have a metal straw. Metal straw. Great for smoothies, because it can't bend. Regular plastic straw, or even worse, whack green straw that they're trying to feed me now, uh, they, they're, they bend a lot. So, like, you know, you suck, and then the straw creates an airtight seal that if you get smoothie through, you deserve the Nobel Science Prize. I don't think that's what they call it. Nobel Peace Prize? What's the science equivalent of the Nobel Peace Prize? It's, um... It's the... <laughs> It's the Einsteino, like a, like a, like a Grammy or an Emmy. It's an Einsteiny. I don't think that's it. <laughs> Something about a. Uh, ooh, I can't believe you want a Steiny. <laughs> I don't think anyone wants that. I'd want a Steiny, bro, <laughs> for for whatever that may mean. Uh, you know, this level it didn't it didn't feel entirely slow. I didn't do the trick. I didn't feel that slow though. Let's split. Let's let's remember. We're on one health for Monkey Yellow, and that guy's a little hard, you know? Sometimes the slam move, it gets me. It, it's, um, it's, it's for babies. It's a baby slam move, but, you know, it gets me. I'm trying, trying to jump over it. Gets me, bro. <laughs> it's, it's all, I've been talking for 37 minutes, and I have so much more to go. I don't know what to do. So we're just gonna, we're just gonna, I want you to hit me. Go on and hit me. Wait, does this do damage? Oh, Ninja Attack will do it. There you go. So, rehydrate. We're gonna take another sip. And, uh, we're gonna go Fantasy Knight, we're gonna smack him up. This is what I needed the explosive bullets for. At least one, I remember. But, so we're gonna hold off on using them because I want to. You know what, we are gonna use them because I think it improves the speed a great deal. Uh, I don't know what happened to our gadgets. I think I was switching them and then it got cancelled by ninja attack. Uh, oh, I guess one does do it, so we're fine there. Yeah, this attack. This is the one. It's so easy to avoid and I'm just such a good... What's that little door for? I never noticed such a cute little door. You put a dog or a cat? Get, get down from there, you you uh, oversized banana munching uh, phil philistine. I don't think philistine is an insult at all. Uh, that's not a net. There we go. Oh, look at the frames I saved by crouching. That's gonna make a big difference in the rest of this run. Oh, I think I'm on PB pace. Split. The next split is called Skyflyer, which has me quite excited. You know, I'm realizing something. I put on my little fuzzy hat. My head is not cold. It's my arms. I gotta find a sweatshirt. In in the summer. It's it's, it's basically the summer. I the the splits are a formality. You know. 
I don't have a sweatshirt. I've given them all to my mother to take home because I thought I wouldn't need them. What a fool I've been. <laughs> yeah, we're back. We're back in the groove. We're on Ape Escape. Um, wait, 13 out of 16. That's, that's a lot of them. That's like, that's like most, right? It's a little crazy. Yes, I remember now. The hoops on circle, cause the sky flyers on square. That's important because it allows me to do the, the funky jumps. Yes. What do you mean that wasn't a ledge grab? I'll kill you, Nintendo. I've been playing a lot of Pokemon Puzzle League, and I've gotten very good at it. So good, in fact, you can't beat me. I'm unbeatable. That's That's been said by the, uh, the greatest Puzzle League player on campus. He said, Andrew, you're unbeatable. <laughs> or should I say, who used to be the greatest Puzzle League player on campus? Here, I'll say it. Andrew's the best Puzzle League player on campus. He's unbeatable. Wait, no, that, I got that wrong. Andrew was unbeatable. That was said by the greatest Puzzle League player on campus. Me, Andrew. It used to be some other guy who also said that, but then I beat him real bad. All right, well, it wasn't real bad. Actually, you know, it was. I don't know if he took a single Pokemon. For those of you who don't know, Pokemon Puzzle League is best of three. Whoever beats the three Pokemon first wins. Uh, we played many games, I think like five total sets, and he didn't take a single Pokemon in any of them. Because I'm too freaking good. Hello! I didn't want to interrupt your little video game, but now that you addressed me. <laughs> what you playing, your Nintendo? I'm playing, yes, Nintendo. I said that actually just before, it is a Nintendo. Nice. Who nice. let that, who let him in? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, are you speedrunning? I'm speedrunning. It's been a while. Yeah. Is this Ape Escape 3? It is. Why is Did it you awesome? see that rocket invincibility? No. It was sick! Why does this game look like crap? What do you mean? It's awesome. What console is this? It's the PS2. The PS2 looked better than this. I remember. I was there. It did not. This is like... <laughs> this is top of the line PS2 graphics. I'm just bothering you. I, I know. I know. I know. Alright, enjoy yourself. I'm gonna go... Uh, jerk off. <laughs> Here? In my room? Nah, in the common room, bro. Oh, alright, that's cool. I'm gonna go do that, too. Alright, we're egg out, brothers. Egg out, brothers! As I mentioned earlier in the video, egg out, my new catchphrase. Uh, I don't know if any of y'all caught that. If you were listening to it earlier in the video, I'm wearing my fuzzy hat. Also, earlier in the video, I mentioned Nick makes fun of me for the fuzzy hat. He didn't do that. He's really growing as a person. <laughs> I, uh... You know, I really thought... I was ready for it. And, you know, he's, he's... Even he's right. It's been a while. I think this upload is gonna bring great joy to the people. I can see it now. Within two minutes of uploading the video, they're gonna say, Oh my god. City Hall's back, and then after two hours of watching the video, they're gonna go, Oh my god, I forgot how really bad he was at Ape Escape 3. It's it's a little funny. So, you know, why, why are you so quiet? Make, make with the jokes, Egg Lord. I'm glad you started addressing me by my my preferred name. That's, that's very cool of you. You know, I, I go to a very liberal school, and preferred names is, is important. And I, I do value them, but, like, not enough that I remember them, and I think that causes me problems, because I forget them quite frequently. And usually, it's not in front of the person's face, and that makes it worse, because if you forget someone's preferred name in front of the person, they just go, eh, whatever, it doesn't mean much, I, I know you're cool. If you forget it to their friends, then it's like, Dude, oh my god, you can't say that. Thank god you didn't say it in front of them. And I go, well, yeah, me too. <laughs> and you go, god, you're, you're such an egghead. And I go, ah, egghead's okay, but you're pushing it. And I go, nah, actually, I would never say that. I love egghead. It's like my favorite. Boom, split, easy. 
Wow, these levels are getting longer, and I'm getting colder. Why am I getting colder? The window's closed. I have a hat on. This sucks. It doesn't suck. I'm having a great time, actually. Except my mouth is drying out incredibly fast, and I'm running out of water. <laughs> Maybe I'll just have to go and get some more. Who cares, right? Yeah, I have, you know, I've been playing the game. I've been giving you anecdotes about myself. I haven't been talking about Ape Escape very much. I think that's because it hasn't changed very much and there's not much to talk about. Next? Nah, the, you know, I... Is, uh... You know, I say that in jest, but it might it might just be true. Uh, I think, you know, the, the blue one, it's supposed to target, unless I've been misled. And where'd he go? You know, it, it pans the camera down so you can look at the obstacle course. Uh, I hate it. I wish it would look- let me look at this stupid monkey man. That's all I ever want in life, is to look at stupid monkey man all day. I wish I could tell you I've been grinding Ape Escape. It's just not true, son. Now, I totally forget what I have to do for here, but I think I had to break that box. Yes, I think I remember now. Yeah, there it is. Woo-hoo-hoo! -hoo. Clean skip, City Hall! <laughs> Th thanks, I, I don't know why you call me that. I mean, most people call me Andrew. City Hall's just a, really a nickname. I don't know why you'd address me to that. It's because I'm in a video. Oh, that makes a lot of sense. You know, I think, I think you're talking to yourself there, City Hall. There you go. Oh yeah. That's right. You know, when you, when you run out of things to talk about, which I have uh, two minutes into the video, if you'll remember, you just, you go back to the tried and true, talking to yourself. It, 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 oh, that's a ledge. I can step on that. What happened to the rocket invincibility that did me so well in the last level? And where's my last monkey, dude? Oh, right, they, there's a whole level left. I forgot. <laughs> You know, it's not, not the worst thing to forget. That means I get to play more Ape Escape, hot dog! You know, I'm looking at the video, I'm seeing it's a little framey. Uh, not, uh, <laughs> not saying there's nothing I can do, but there's nothing I will do. So, uh, sorry. Oh, I was supposed to go on a fantasy night for this one. I totally forgot. And now, now my tummy's rumbling and I'm, and I'm hungry, but I still have so much Ape Escape left to play. I'm, I'm thinking, and I hate to be the one to tell you this, and you probably knew from the length of the YouTube video. Like, hmm, I don't think he got the world record, so I'm pretty sure this run gets, uh, gets the axe, so to speak. I did not mean to do that. At all. Like, in the least. <laughs> what is that? This, uh, this Bruce Wizard, he goes. I know your secret, Bruce Wizard. You have no magic at all. In the least. <laughs> what a good video. Bruce Wizard, if you haven't seen it, is a, an excellent watch. I'm not gonna put it in the description. There's no way I'll remember to do that. But anyway, uh, I'm hungry. So, the video... I'm not going to beat the whole game, but I think you've got what you came for, and you're welcome, basically, is how I feel about that. You ever see, uh, you ever see Moana? I didn't, but, there's, you know, it, it's pretty easy to, to remember the song because of all the memes. Uh, I'll, I'll sing it for you if you want. What's that? You don't want to hear it? Oh, alright. <laughs> Sorry then. Just keep making with the funnies, egghead. You got it. I'll do that. Never never passing up on an egghead up to- There's a- I was supposed to- There's a monkey I'm missing. <laughs> Where'd he go? Um, yeah, about that. I don't know. <laughs> well, guess I'm going to Legoland. Sure hope there's a monkey in here quick. Not that it really matters, you know? I don't know if I've seen this in, like, years. I also don't know how to get up there with the robot. 
Um. So hey, where was the? Give me a give me a monkey, though. I don't know where to go. What um? Uh, help? What is this? Uh, ninja ninja room? Surely there's. A, I do not remember this at all, dude. <laughs> Where's my monkeys? This is probably, you know, I think it just approached worst run of my life territory. But I think that's okay. You know, sometimes you gotta have a worst run of your life, especially when you're not gonna finish it. But you know what? There's definitely, there's a monkey in here. There's gotta be. You're kidding me. Where's where's my monkey? Hello. No, guys, guys, this is not <laughs> this is not a monkey. I you you're killing me here. I mean, I I don't remember this like at all ever even playing it my first time through. I've definitely done it before because I 100% of the game, I know that. But, uh, what, what's, what's going on here, guys? You really gonna make me wait this long? This is absurd. I chose probably the worst possible way to look for this monkey. I don't know why there's no backup on this level. If, uh... Well, I guess I've never missed the monkey before. Here we go. Thank you. What is, uh... Oh, it's Banjo-Kazooie. The, not the Crystal Skulls, but the weird, I think it's like potted plants in the haunted house level, they go, Thank you. God, I love those guys. Oh, split. Oh, great level. Wow, that really only took, like, nope, that is, that is 15 minutes. I thought it was six. We're, we're good. We're in the clear. Wait a minute. No, that is six minutes. That's not a long time. Wow. Great job! For how, for how like completely awful that level went, I'm proud. If I was like totally ballin', I'd have strats to hit this button with a slingshot. Uh, I don't think I'm the ball. Uh, it's because I'm not supposed to hit the button. Oh, I've I'm such a goon. What did, what did I do to deserve this? Life is pain, etc., etc. Oh, she makes me so mad. Oh, she makes me so mad. Actually, I think it might be a dude. I think I think most of the monkeys in this game, if not all of them, I think are just dudes in lady costumes. I think it's like a plot point. They have a bunch of funny comics about it in Ape Escape 2. What happened to my funny comics from Ape Escape 2? Why aren't that in Ape Escape 3? Why do I speedrun this stupid game instead of the absolute Chad game, Ape Escape 2? You think I can make it? Ooh, that <laughs> Maybe if you did a double jump. <laughs> Alright. Alright, that's... This is getting ridiculous. I mean... You saw that. I don't think those deserve it. I was sitting in the boat. I'm sure you... I don't have to tell you that. You saw it. We all saw it. It's only the game that's doing me dirty. Smooth. The only, the only smooth thing I've done- I just missed the cookie. I went over it entirely, and I'm probably gonna need it for this guy, but I'm gonna pretend like I don't, and I'm gonna die after, like, a minute of fighting him. But anyway. Again. You see, every time I say, but anyway, I'm trying to get back to the topic I was talking about. And then I get on the, but anyway, topic. And I forget what I was talking about, which causes me to say, but anyway, again. <laughs> well, I don't want to do it to you, but I'm gonna, but anyway. Oh, and then I forgot what I was gonna say again. This is, I'm, I'm having a lot of fun just, uh, making myself go crazy. I'm already crazy. Now I remember the strat, uh, they did at AGDQ, 
uh, that one year I watched Ape Escape 3 was they got on this guy's back. I don't think it's the fast way of doing it. Uh, I already did it though. Sorry. You know, I wonder what I should get for lunch today. Or, you know, linner as, uh, as the kids call it. I wake up just in time for linner. Uh, which, which door? This one? Yeah, no. Yeah. It's gotta be this one. Good save. Well, you know, I mean, bad in the first place. You wouldn't have to save it if you paid an ounce of attention, but... Well, what's the expression? An ounce of prevention is worth a pound of cure? I think that's actually the expression. You know, normally when I do that, I just get the expression wrong, right? I think... I think I got lucky that time. Let's go. Why did the hoop make me go slower? I'd like to ask the, the jury on that one. By the way, I'm the jury. I, I say it's unfair and I demand a refund. You think it's too late to refund Ape Escape 3? I've been, I've been playing the game on, you know, several occasions for, for like, just a long time. Uh, you think if I, like... I think I bought it online. You think if I... No, I bought it at a game store that's closed now. Dang, dude. Definitely can't get a refund. I'm supposed to have the slingshot out. No, I have to wait a whole cycle. Thanks, Custom Ink. Come on, hitboxes. Let's go! That was early. Like, you know, not as early as actually doing it right, but, uh... That was early. It's okay, you don't have to pretend. I know, I know you're proud of me. Ooh, proud of that too. Why didn't I trip? That's a, that's a gracious gift. Thank you very much, Jollymon. I think it goes like this. I got- I did them in the wrong order, but I had the right idea. I'm sorry, you're supposed to fall over. Alright. Not a bad level. Well, it was bad, like all of them, but not- not bad comparatively. These levels are a lot shorter than I thought. I thought they were all like 10 minutes. I guess that would make for a way longer run than I have time for. Well, I have all the time in the world, really. But... All right, I'll tell you what. Let's let's look in the the last two levels are very long, so I'm gonna tell you we're stopping once we beat Monkey Red. No, you know what? Those levels are long too. We're we're stopping. The level after pink, and then and then that's that's enough run for that for today. It was good. It's a good run. I think Ape Escape is a bit too long of a game to speed run. Maybe I'll do some Bean Machine speed runs on YouTube. And you know, uh, I know big YouTubers say this, and they can say this because they have a lot of ravaging fans that want to see things. But uh, I would love it if you told me what you wanted to see in the comments. Or in person, because most of you know me. Like, all of you, probably. Uh, you know, I, I doubt anyone's, uh, you know, surfing through the web being like, Oh, I'm gonna look for City Hall? 50 subscribers? He sounds like a great time. And he is a great time. I ain't trying to put myself down, but... When I'm looking for YouTubers, I don't look for the for the ones with uh, 15 subscribers. I, I look for, you know, you're pretty much just Northern Lion exclusively, to be honest. But uh, if hypothetically I, I were to look for a YouTuber, a new one to watch that I haven't heard of before, I probably wouldn't start in the 0 to 50 range. I'd go to the... 10 million to a, baz a gazillion range, as I think, you know, the sensible option would to be to do. Uh, talking becomes harder when your your mouth is extremely dry and filled with saliva and you're hungry and tired and been playing Ape Escape for an hour yet? 50. Very close to an hour. That's gonna be some major gamer cred, dude. Egg out.
That, that's the default. We, we, we've hit default, boys. When, when I'm totally out of things to say, my brain goes, egg out, dude. <laughs> There's a simple flowchart. And uh, right now, I can only see, like, two steps of the flowchart. Outline them for you. Okay, I'll do it. You know what I mean? Maybe you could say please next time. Uh, they go, can you... No, that's not how it goes. They go, say egg out. And there's a little branch. Yes and no. And then both of those just, just have a little question mark at the end because I'm not really sure what that means. But uh, regardless, you say egg out no matter what. And, you know, it's, it's usually, it's uh, it's a beautiful thing that you can't see on video, but it's usually associated with a little hand gesture. It's, uh, my my two center fingers are, are whatever the opposite of outstretched is, uh, in-condensed. Uh, the, my two middle fingers are in-condensed. Ho, 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 you dropped me from the ledge for the last time, Mr. Bond. I don't think that's that's ever said in, in any of the movies, really. But, um, yeah, regardless, egg out gets said. Oh, yeah, 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 the hand gesture. So my two middle fingers are, are in-condensed, and my two outward fingers are outwardly stretched. It's not a, it's not a unique hand gesture, it's just something that's hard to describe in words, because I'm not sure if it has a name. I think I might have been heard it called devil horns, but I think it's also, like, similar to the peace sign in some circles, so I don't want to... You know, I'm not saying that, you know, you might be put in the comments, Oh, uh, well, that's wrong. Technically, it's this. But, you know, if it's wrong, and I don't know what it is, I can't say the correct definition, because if I don't know what it is, chances are a lot of other people aren't going to know what it is either. So what's, uh, what's the point? Uh, dancing. I remember that, you know? I don't have the audio on when I play, as you can probably tell, because I haven't made reference to any of the audio cues. Um, but I do remember she whips out those maracas and goes, Dancing! I think it's it's hilarious. I was supposed to stay in genie mode. <laughs> G genie trigger. <laughs> dude, back on the Marvel 3 thing, that game's hot, dude. You got, like, wave dashes, you got Doctor Doom going, do 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 foot dive. It, it's... I, I love Phoenix Wright, obviously, as I think most people do. He's a big fan favorite, <laughs> like myself. Uh, oh, split! And we got, you know, I've been good about the splits. I haven't been mentioning it. Also, we're at an hour, let's go. Uh, oh, man! The level I promised to do is, is labeled Snore Boring Level. I don't, I don't know exactly what that's supposed to mean, but, like, I am excited for it, I'll tell you that much. Maybe you're excited for it. I don't... I don't know why you would be. Why would I... <laughs> why would I say that? Come on. Come on, I know this strat works. Yes! That's damage. We're good. We're in the clear. <laughs> That's a lot of damage. You guys remember that? Jack Nicholson or whatever his name is. Huge meme. Come on. Hit the... Hit the pink one. There you go. That's the, this is a good fight, it's looking like a one cycle. Or not a one cycle, but you know, a pre-angerment cycle. Ooh. Let's go. Ho 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 ho! Good fight, City Hall! Stop calling me City Hall, that's weird. I'd honestly prefer Eggman. You know, I mean, egg jokes, they're hilarious. And yeah, I, I know I told you to stop calling me Eggman, but it's, it's a funny name. You can call me whatever you want. City Hall's just a little weird. You know, the people in Smash Bros Club at college, they they uh, they uh know me as City Hall. They, they see me on the street and they go, Yo, what's good, City Hall? And then my friend from high school is over, and he's like, that's gross, and I hate you. By the way, my friend from high school is Sean, and I've, I've seen him. I know he's still watching the video. Probably the only one at this point. I, I think Ryan might have dropped out. I, I think I think he's out of there. I think I think we're just left with Sean. That, that's my prediction, at least. It could be him. My, my mom might even stick through if she likes the commentary enough. I don't know. 
my mom likes me. <laughs> I, I, you know, a sad boy humor would be to throw in a, an I think at the end there, but I, I know my mom likes me. She makes it very clear. And of course I like my mom too, I like both my parents and my whole family. Never get it twisted. <laughs> you will never hear about the things or people I do not like on camera. Except, uh, bad bean machine beans. I will always be very outward. I hate it now and forever. They stink. They can, they can go die and never come to me again. I don't like bad beans. And man, am I glad we're stopping after this level. It is so hard to force myself to talk through the- If I get captured by this guy, the runs- <laughs> I'm stopping. I'll be straight up with you. I do not tolerate getting caught by Pinsherman. He's only the second strongest monkey in the game. Third strongest. Next to- It goes... Scorpimon, Spectre, Pinsherman. That, that, that's my, my, uh, power ranking order. Do not at me. Uh, I've been watching Dragon Ball for years. I know how this, how this works. Oh my god, I cannot believe that that wasn't enough of a net float. Uh, hello? And, you know, City Hall, he used to have the, the cleanest and the greatest net floats in the game. I've been losing it. Oh my god. I don't want to talk about that, but I will. Did you see what just happened there? <laughs> I got hit on the ceiling. You know, that ain't that ain't the best net float, but if it gets you there, it is the best net float. It's better than the previous two. The previous two might have gone higher, but you know, what? what's higher than, than getting to your destination, brother? Egg out. <laughs> Ooh, I, I am funny. Uh, you know, if you can make yourself laugh, that, that's when you know you really, you really hit on comedy gold. Just put your RC car in the drink. You don't need it anyway. Oh, can I ding it? I can ding it. Good thing. I'm sure that's the noise it made. I think I'm pretty sure it makes that exact noise. Good thing. And that'll be really embarrassing if it doesn't make a noise because I have sound off, so I have no clue. Uh oh. Who's ready for a city hall skip? Ooh. <laughs> oh, is this one hard? I thought this one was easy. No, this one's supposed to be easy. Come on. Come on. Come on. I forgot how to do it, but come on. Come on. I know you can do it. Come on, put me in the wall. Put me in the wall. Ooh -hoo -hoo. You know, I notice a lot of the time when I do ooh -hoo -hoo, I sound like a, like Tigger from Winnie the P I don't think I have to tell you who Tigger's from. What Tigger's from. Where? What? What Tigger's from? I don't think I have to talk to you about you know who Tigger is. Uh, I sound a lot like Tigger, you know. -hoo -hoo -hoo. B bouncing tail, Pooh Bear. <laughs> Bring me. I need sacrifice, Pooh Bear. <laughs> that's just, I think that's someone else who, who, who goes like. Uh, oh no! No, it's Yogi Bear. I I I, I need sacrifice, Boo Boo. <laughs> Bring me picnic basket <laughs> or. <laughs> Virgins to sacrifice in the volcano. <laughs> Man, I that that's I'd watch that. Me voicing Winnie the not Winnie the Pooh. What's what's this Yogi Bear? Me voicing Yogi Bear. Tell tell you know, but I'm I'm a I'm a sun god. I think I'd make a great sun god, mainly because I'm bald now and extremely arrogant due to the fact that I'm bald. I'm sure you'll notice. Uh, in, in the old City Hall videos, I used to say, Man, I'm playing so bad. Why are you watching me? Go watch someone else. Nah, nah. Not anymore. Now I know I'm the hot stuff. Uh, now I'm a hunk and everyone loves me. <laughs> I know, I, I think that's uh, the dude from the commercial on Anchor Arms and Spongebob. Excellent episode. Uh, another hot slammer, possibly my favorite Spongebob quote of all time. Mm, can I interest anyone in the ugh, juice bar? Alright, well, there's the level for you. I'm gonna stop now. I hope you had a wonderful City Hall experience. Please remember to uh, 
I don't know, stay subscribed. I'm sure you all already hit the notification bell. It's not a not a huge commitment when you only upload like what two videos a year, probably less. Uh, that Captain Planet video was a slammer. You should go watch that. I loved it. Th thank you. Have a have a great night.